Good morning. Sonia from Adoya Outdoors here. It's a beautiful day. Hope you're having a good one so far. I wanted to share a bit about the benefits of forest therapy today and I've recently finished a blog on this so I'll be posting that onto the website soon but here's like a quick sort of run through of what those main benefits are. <clears throat> so just to sort of say what forest therapy is so um, <clears throat> the practice takes being in nature because we all know time spent in nature is good for us it takes being in nature one step further and focuses on connecting to nature and that's when you're starting to develop a compassionate relationship for the natural world around us that includes human beings and there's this uh, clinical psychologist Scott B who says it I think brilliantly the intent is to put people in touch with the present moment in a profoundly deep way. The sights, sounds, smells, and I added in textures, uh, of the forest take us right into that moment so our brains stop anticipating, recalling, ruminating and worrying. Oh, there's a caterpillar just about to climb onto my phone, which you're, you're not going to be able to see, but it's quite cool for me to watch that. Right, hello. <laughs> So, so that's what forest therapy is. Yeah, it's about getting really deeply immersed in the moment. So taking mindfulness um, and doing it, connecting with nature in the forest. So it's amazing. So the benefits that I talk about now are proven for, are proven if you spend a, a two hour session immersed in a forest therapy experience in the woods. So you won't get these benefits from doing a brisk walk through the woods, chatting with friends, walking the dog, um, or if you do less than two hours, you know, so it was proven, all of this stuff is proven on the basis of a two hour immersive experience. So first reason why you should do forest therapy, it's a stress buster. So it is proven that the cortisol levels and the cortisol is the, the, the stress hormone um, it's proven that that reduces as we spend time out in nature, deeply immersed in a, in a state of relaxation. We're able to get out of the fight or flight mode that we spend way too much time in these days. It's useful if you want to get excited or, you know, respond to danger, but we don't need to be in it most of the time, but we are. So it gets us out of that, um, lowers the production of the stress hormone cortisol. Stress causes so many other illnesses and diseases, so that's a massive one. Um, number two, boost your immune system. So it's proven, again, that spending time in forests, so you wouldn't get this from other areas of nature, because the trees emit like uh, essential oils, basically, um, and they're called phytoncides and those phytoncides, we breathe those in and they increase the count of and the activity in the cells within our body that fight off things like cancer and other bacteria infections. And it's also proven that by doing a forest therapy session and kicking off that process, that increased activity continues for several weeks after the session. So it's not like a one hit wonder. I'm just noticing the blackbirds that I feed have, have appeared for their raisin breakfast. Well, I'll be there in a minute. Uh, reducing your anxiety levels. So this is a biggie. Um, almost all my customers have anxiety. I have anxiety. And I can definitely say that when I did the, for me, it's definitely a, um, lowers my anxiety, but also I collected data at the, when I first started out and every single anxiety score was reduced as the session went on and again it's about it, it allows you to sort of stay in that lowered anxiety zone for longer even when you finished better emotional well-being who doesn't want to feel better so <clears throat> it allows you to kind of yeah as i was saying earlier like feel compassion for the natural world and also that includes your fellow human beings so you you know you feel ha healthier happier the sense that life is worthwhile you're part of something bigger and an increased ability to feel 
compassion and trust and kindness and warmth towards us, others. And lastly, it gives your energy levels a boost. So you wouldn't think so necessarily because we spend the whole time like immersed in this state of deep relaxation. But many people report afterwards, oh, you know, I'm ready, raring to go now. And yeah, the, 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 the science backs that up as well. So they are <clears throat> just like a, the main five benefits that I see to doing this practice. Uh, if you want to be one of the first to try it here in the UK, because there's not very many of us at the moment, um, get in touch. Uh, you can contact me through Adore Your Outdoors on the Facebook page or www.adoreyouroutdoors.co.uk. And yeah, I'd love to help you see if you can awaken your senses and start your nature connection journey. Right, I'll see you later. Got to go and sort these blackbirds out. <laughs> Have a good day. Bye.